So finally, after a long time of planning, going back and forth, talking to different brands to sponsor, to help because the funding was a bit on the high side for what the dream I had, I, will, I with the, my team, were able to pull, to, uh, to pull off our first training. We called it the Frank Donga MSc. It's not a master's degree, it's just Frank Donga Media Skill Classes. Again, I always draw from my personal experience. There was a time when I was working for a company and things were rough, they couldn't pay me for a long time, almost a year, almost a year. I didn't even feel it. I was doing wedding photography all over the place. I had invested in one small camera and a few lenses and a small laptop. I don't even know say they're not pay. Now, anytime they like, they pay. I've realized that skills and problem solving is what's going to make sure you excel or get by as a young person in Nigeria of today. So finally, uh, we got the support of a, of a hotel, Radisson Blue. They gave us a place to use for the training. And I decided the best thing I can give back is not just the money. Is knowledge, the knowledge that has helped me come this far. I've not used my certificate to apply for a job one day since I left, even master's degree. I've not gotten a job because of my master's degree in school. No, it was skill, skill, skill. What problem I can solve? And I can see a lot of people doing the same. So and that's what I want to transfer to other young Nigerians. So that was the initiative behind it, to empower youths with skills that have worked for me. The media industry is huge. In America, I think Hollywood is like the number one contributor after maybe other major sectors non-oil to their GDP. Probably one of the highest employers of labor. Hollywood is big, it's contributing tremendously to, to America. Even in Nigeria, Nollywood is huge. People get employed on movie sets, post-production, costume, makeup, online promotion, PR every day. Music promot promoters, you know, stage managers, music producers, um, uh, music video editors, a lot of em employment can be generated. And guess what, so far, not our politics has impressed other parts of the world. Not our engineering has impressed other parts of the world. Even our sport, they struggle. But our music and our movies and our comedy, they, they penetrate other parts. Probably the only respect we have now internationally is just because of our music self and our mu movies. That's all that's remaining. So that was the reason why I created that ma free master class is to empower people for free so that you can come. My friends and I will teach you what we know for free. You can build on that and then see you at the top. Uh, we don't have a date yet. We're working on it because it takes a lot of Personally, I would love to have at least one training every month for free for people, for beginners. Then, if possible, probably evolve it into like a mini school where we can train people probably every, week, every, every weekend. Well, that looks like it's the obvious reality, you know, because right now the costs are enormous. There's no way I'm going to be able to bear that cost every time. You know, it's, it's enormous. People have, and again, people need to learn to give value for what you want. I've, I, that's how I did it. So, and I've learned that people don't appreciate what they get for free or just like that. Not everybody will appreciate that, you know. So, but for the beginners, to introduce you to so that you can build on that is free. So we want to, get to, want to get to the, to the advanced learning. We might need to monetize later on, but not now. We still want to concentrate on free and 